I went to go get a slice of pizza at like 2 a.m. Uh, on my own, and I was skating there, and I was, I was driving past, or not driving, I was skating past a church, and then I didn't realize, but there was this homeless lady there, and she literally, as soon as I got like right into vision of her, she was like, get away from me! Oh, and I was like, oh my god. Like, I literally, like, I jumped out of my skin. I like, I was like, oh my god, I'm so sorry. And then I crossed the road and just <laughs> went on my way, but she was like, oh, sorry, I was talking on the phone. And I'm like, no, yeah, right. Yeah, what? Yeah, what phone? You're bro, crazy. Phone, bro. Like, it was literally like so loud. I, I don't think I've ever gotten more scared like that ever. It was so, oh my such god. a you, like, have like, you have like you have like the effed up stories too. You have like the worst it food is, stories. It was scary, but I got my I pizza. Like, Hell yeah! I feel like we'd have worse is. stories if we actually went out like Grunk does. Like if we went to like Sixth Street like every weekend. Uh, or something like that, dude, like I went. We have when we went to Sixth Street to watch uh, like a comedy show. I saw like some guy eating Cheetos off the ground. It was pretty chill. It was like a pile <laughs> of Cheeto puffs, and they're like nice. that homeless <laughs> lady was following us around. Yeah, I did not feel okay. Yeah, bro. I was scared, dude. Do, don't Sixth she Street was, like almost no, naked. Dude. Yeah, it was scary. It was almost naked. I didn't want to like do anything. I was like, I want to go home, play a video game, and go to sleep. <sighs> yeah, and that was that was really weird. It was like you know how you're like having a conversation with somebody. And you're standing like two feet apart. She was just like walking in between people who were like doing that. And like, she like would stand there for two seconds. Like, no room. Like, she would like be in your face, like, <laughs> <laughs> like do that, dude. Like, what are you doing? I don't know you. <laughs> around here, get away from around me. here. You like you can start to remember the the homeless people. And like, there's this one guy. He's like we call him the wizard because he literally walks around with like a cape <laughs> slash blanket <laughs> on him at all times. And he's like chill as hell. And he literally, he'll stand on the sidewalk and just go like. Like he's solving equations in the sky, and it's like, it's what if he's like, oh my like god, super oh my god, smart. <laughs> I, I yeah, gave him a he cookie. Does know everything. I literally Dude. got, I, I gave him a cookie, and he was like, is this laced with anything? And I was like, nope, there's just a cookie. And he's like, thank <laughs> you. Say, <laughs> smart. He, he just he said, said thank, thank you. you. Yeah. We have there like a, a, go ahead. We have like a town hero in our town. Um, I can't remember his name, but. He dresses like a pimp. He wears like all purple. He has a big purple hat yes. with a feather and he has a cane. Like, leopard? Like, like, leopard. <laughs> like, yeah, it is. No, it's actually real. Yeah, it looks exactly like that. But the mm -hmm. thing is, every, he's famous. He's a town hero because he doesn't have like any women. He doesn't have any girls. So he just like walks around and he like buys things for people. He's like actually crazy. He's literally a town hero. Not here, right? What? No, it's in my hometown. He's like, uh, gotcha. he's just like, he's I'm the town pimp. I've never seen we a call town him, pimp here. In no, 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 no. no. We, the town pimp, but he does like, he doesn't have any girls. He just walks around. He's like, town he's, pimp, but he's just like really nice. He's chill. Helpful. Yeah, no, he's, he's like really helpful. <laughs> <laughs> he was helpful. He's like bringing in groceries missions. from people. No, that's real. Oh, it was awesome. Yeah, where weird. I grew up, there was a guy who was homeless but for some reason he had a motorcycle and he would literally uh -huh. lay down and sleep on a bench and he would just stay there all day and like sometimes he'd break dance and then other times he would just sit there and he would turn on the motorcycle on the sidewalk and he would just go wow, 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 wow. <laughs> and then he'd start dancing and he'd take another nap and I, that was it he just lived there nice nice <laughs> It was pretty we cool. Bring, we should bring these people on, dude. We guess. should. I'll bring my town pimp up. I'll bring, bring my town pimp. pimp I'll get the wizard guy. Bring, mm -hmm. bring the. Just see what happens. Like, <laughs> just let them like lead the podcast. Yeah, I'll, 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 I'll sit back like this. Like, yeah, it's his no, dude. Floor. We're not even in the podcast. We're yeah, just, like we monitoring. Leave. We're like making sure everything's okay. But they're sitting in our setups, and they're like, <laughs> "I come in. You guys need water or anything? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, lemonade and cookies. Get away from me! Get away from me now!" <laughs> That'd be such a good podcast idea where you like bring on guests and they're like quirky and fun and you just let them take charge of the podcast. Yep, you just talk yeah, like you I'm are the, you, man, such a Craigslist. good like conversation, like but conversationist. Well, obviously you're, you're I don't think we shouldn't do it at this house. We shouldn't do yeah, it. We should bro. do it like in a building or something. Yeah, like on this location. Yeah. Like, an abandoned warehouse. Yeah. <laughs> we should do it in an abandoned warehouse with like one where the echo is really like, bad. Like, the light every now and then. Whoa, cool. Yeah, it's like being a light bulb. Mm hmm. That'd be so much fun. Oh, Just like listening that. to what they want to randomly talk about. Dude, there's a rat the size of a shoe in our garage. And I say, <laughs> <laughs> it's yeah, the size is. of a loafer. And I saw yeah, when I opened the is. door to go get a glass of milk and some applesauce, I see go <laughs> like a herd, but it was one rat and it was huge. It was like this big. And I is screamed. Really big? I swear to God, he's the size of like a clown shoe. He's really it's the big. Brown sh it's the brown it's shoe. It's the brown rat, loafer dude. rat. That's what we, the brown yeah. shoe rat. That's I'm what actually, we call right after this podcast, rat. I think I'm going to go to the store and get some mouse traps. Gets, I think I'm going to go. He poops a lot. So he's getting fed good. Dude, he's getting eaten. He's eating so much. I think. I think we're gonna see him walking around with like a newspaper, like, yeah, yeah, you guys are doing. <laughs> well, I told, I told Larry yesterday when he had the camera out, I was like, bro, like, I, I've seen, I've seen a trash bag, like, there's no trash bag in the garage, 
Then I see a trash bag get put in the garage. And then an hour later, I see a hole this big in the trash bag in the yeah. garage. And I'm yep. like, bro, he's yeah. making his wow. way into every bag. Dude, I think yeah. he's living in the plushies that are in there. I think he's just living. He's I hope he's not. Nice kind of, I hope he's not either. I say wow. we, we gas the whole thing out. Yeah, yeah just this green Urban fog. Dude, I it seeps into our rooms. Like, <laughs> oh, give him no. like edible gummies, and then he's going to be walking around. Wait, and he's oh. Like, just like, oh, no, we did. We did have an idea to give him like a bunch of edibles. A set, so he's just like gummy. standing on his hind legs in the middle of the garage, <laughs> like out of he's his a, mind high. He's it's like cooking like gamer idea. soups. He's like. <laughs> yeah. He's like. Looking through the bag like. Yeah. Hey Larry. <laughs> hey Larry. Oh. Yeah, that that garage is actually kind of scary. I'm uh, dude. I, I I got gloves. I want to go in there and just. I want to clean it all out. I need to get rid of all that garbage. Mm. Need to get rid of it all. And poop. And poop. And a rat. A lot. Actually, if I see the rat, I'm gonna like train him. I'm gonna catch. I'm gonna keep him. Oh. Yeah, I'm oh. gonna keep him. Train him to hide. Yep. Train him to so hide. Funny. The- <laughs> <laughs> It's really funny. <laughs> it's really funny to like imagine the cat when we open the door and he's like <laughs> behind the tire. <laughs> <She's> like, <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's go. <laughs> Dude, what if it's more than one? Dude, it's probably a it whole is. family. It is 100. percent That was probably that was like Papa Red. That was Papa Red. Yeah. Usually uh, they're not alone, right? Yeah. I mean, they no, they, they come they in packs. Friends. Yeah. Yeah, you ever watch Ratatouille? Mm-hmm. So yeah. One, and then they call the whole herd. <laughs> yep. and right when you said co- that, I imagine the chandelier. I imagine the, the chandelier, chandelier and, the, and, then, and then it just falls through. And they oh, our garage is a convention for them. Scary. It's literally a con for these rats. They come in, they're like, oh my Rat God. Con. Is <laughs> Rat con. Rat con. A new trash rat came in. Everybody come through. Come yes! through. Yes! <laughs> it's like, it's like, at the front, like, uh, by the garage doors, cheese. I don't got any cheese on me. Ah, get the fire Yeah, there's here. like a bouncer. Cheese. There's a line of rats, like. <laughs> <laughs> You're not on the list. <laughs> I, I was get on the here. list. I, I heard you got Papa John's tonight. <laughs> <laughs> what oh, do you have on the on menu? The well, I have a Chick fil A sauce packet. I got a, <laughs> yeah. uh, some fire sauce. <laughs> uh, 40 ounce smoothie. Burrito. I have a burrito in his bag. <laughs> <laughs> I'll take the burrito with the Chick fil A sauce. All right, oh, there you go. Ew. Oh, no, never mind. It's already out. Some guy already ate it. <laughs> What else we got here? <laughs> we got Skittles. Um, we got Airheads. Uh, Nerds Clusters. No, that's gone. <laughs> I love him. Oh. I'm going to find him. Yeah. Uh. You should find him. You should put him on your head and see if he pulls your hair. Start to break dance. Ah! Ah! It's probably that. underneath your head. <laughs> Take, off your head. Take off your head. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's like there's like four. There's four of them, yeah. yeah. Come on! Did they all come out of my desk? <laughs> so the rat's holding that mic right there. She's like, We have kids. It picks up my desk. Like, <laughs> You've been I'm a rat the whole, whole time. You, all my whole your stomach opens up. up on rats. <laughs> <laughs> my whole operation to have a rat factory. Oh. Let's start domesticating rats. Yeah, let's actually yeah, take actually, them in. No, that's I saw a, that's homeless guy idea. teach him tricks. Like he'd like play fetch and he'd, he'd do like make him run over to him and then he'd like grab onto his like his finger and he'd finger. like make him do a flip. <gasps> have you seen the, the the homeless guy who has like an, uh, a fly on a string? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, he's like, uh, look, he? I domesticated yeah, like, a fly, bro. Look, <laughs> it's actually it's, insane. It flies so interestingly. It's like very unnatural. How do they did do that? It's really unnatural. I don't know dude. what he did. I, did I think he made he it fall put it asleep. In a cup of ice. Yeah, he put it asleep. There's another guy on TikTok who taught a fly. I think it was a fly or a bee or something to like um to like walk a certain way, like walk, like go here, and it'll walk to it. It wouldn't fly. It would just like walk normally to it, <laughs> and then it will stop. Until it's given another command. Holy it's shit. like, all right, walk this way. He'll tap there. It's insane. Dude, these people are the smartest know. people alive. Like, they Most know people have so much time. They just be like, <laughs> yeah. rats and mice and just, bees. That's and what bees. I want to do. Yeah, I guess. If I ever disappear, you can just find me, like, training my little army of, like, creatures in the woods. Dude, just doing something. It's sweet. It's pretty sweet. And it's chill. That would be kind of chill. What was the idea that we had recently about 40,000 ants? Or 20,000 ants. 10,000 ants. Oh, 10,000 ants. <laughs> Fuck. The dude, no, that yeah, was me. I think that it was, was 10,000 ants. That was no, me. I remember, that was, I remember oh, no, yeah, something 10, about ants. We that was on, not that much. 10, you seem like so checked out, but I think you heard every word. I heard every single word. You said something about 10,000 ants. Fire ants. No, I actually don't it was remember. 10, now. <laughs> it was just 10,000 ants, the movie. I was like, what if we made Oh, yeah, that's right. Movie? It, was a, it was a Quentin Tarantino movie. It was the first yeah. one we watched. <laughs> uh, Once Upon a Time in Hollywood. But we he did just, not make a movie called 10,000 Ants. Yeah, yes, we he like, did. Look up Quentin Tarantino, like, 10,000 Ants. Presents 
10,000 ants. <laughs> <laughs> would you watch it? <laughs> I don't remember any of the Two. plot we had, but... I don't remember. I either. would make a movie called 10,000 Ants, and I wouldn't... I wouldn't. We have a lot of scripts, by the way. If there's any, uh, any sort of director that wants to pick up a script... Or some sort of writing. We have a lot of those. We got a lot of million dollar yeah, ideas. Scary Ooh. comedy movies. Yep. Yeah. Uh, we got like all types of like uh, you know sad movies. We got action movies that uh, are on the line. So let us know and we'll write something. Think like movie production. Larry Tanner and I could make the next scary movie, like the scary movie because. series. No, absolutely, absolutely. Because the we bits could. we were thinking of as we're watching scary movie. Remember the 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 cabinet bit? No, dude. We weren't even watching. We were watching. Um, was it actual an actual uh, scary movie? The Conjuring. We we're watching yeah, the Conjuring, an actual the first scary one. movie. An actual scary movie, and we could come up with. We were like thinking that. of scary movie bits, like what would happen in a scary movie if this was scary movie? And there was this girl <laughs> who was like, she had bruises on her face for some reason, and she was looking in the medicine cabinet. She opened it and closed it, and we were thinking, what if every time she closed it, there was more, and she had like a genuine <laughs> reaction to, oh, like, oh my god, and then she would like open it to get more medicine, close it, and there's like more. She's like, oh, no, okay, what? To be fair, most of our bits tend to be like that. It's like repetitive. one thing getting either bigger, brighter. It's very repetitive. It's kind of like that. It's like that one scene where the uh, police officer has With the hat. The hat, the hat gets bigger, bigger and bigger. <laughs> yeah, it's like all that stuff, you know. Or, or like when, uh, what was it like the eight mile parody when he'd be like thrown off the window and he'll get up immediately. <laughs> he gets on, yeah, like, I'm done, man. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. He gets thrown out of the glass window. He's like, man, I'm done. <laughs> uh. All right, I'd love to make a movie. That's, that's I love to make a movie. Yeah. Ten thousand likes on this, we'll we'll make a movie. Tonight. Ten thousand likes, I'll make ten thousand. <laughs> we'll, 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 we'll make a movie on Gamer Subs. Group, uh, on we'll make Gamer Subs. Lean. We'll yeah. make it about yeah. Lean. Listen, we all got to drink yeah. Lean, right? Thank we'll you guys for tuning in. Yeah. Character. I hope you enjoyed this week's episode of the Group Chat Podcast. We're approaching uh, kind of the closing of a chapter mm -hmm. here. A few we are. Days. We actually. We are. We are. If uh, anything, this is the last podcast ever, and you'll never see us again. Well, maybe not. True. Yeah. Ten episode ten's oh, coming man. up, and we're excited episode for it. Ten is gonna be big milestone. <laughs> ten's gonna be nuts. <laughs> big milestone. Yeah, big, season big one's big coming milestone. to a close. Season uh, two is uh, gonna uh, be uh, all. Wait, hang on. Yeah. Sparkly. One hundred. Damn. Whoa, back. Whoa that's tough. Yeah. It, it says oh oh one, but that's oh. so cool. Yeah. It's gonna be flipped in the. Be, never mind. <laughs> Oh my! Yup, you got you got crazy okay. fingers, son. I can't do it, but yep, episode one hundred is gonna be nuts. Oh, I can do it. No, I can't. Thank you for joining us. Make sure you use code. You look at mine. Send off all gamer subs orders. <laughs> Get you some lean. Check out the new drop, smoke shop or whatever it's called. I forget. Smoke show. Wait. Smoke show. Smoke, smoke show. show. We'll see you guys smoke next show. week for uh. <laughs> hey, what is what's going on? What is that? Well, we'll oh, just see. podcast. You'll see the episode. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, we'll you'll figure see, it out. Bro. We'll see you guys soon. Thank you for tuning in. Let's bro fist it out. Goodbye. Later, guys. Right. Have a good <laughs> <freaking> week. <laughs> oh.